What is up, YouTube? Still or sideline? We are back with another Saturday game used pickups here. Uh, I bought a box a while ago. You probably don't remember me. I don't. It's been so long. You might remember if you guys watched the videos, all of them. Uh, but I got uh, the the Shea Townsend AFC Championship game cleats, 2005 Super Bowl year uh, cleats. In that one, he sold them to me thinking they were Super Bowl game use cleats, but I, I was able to photo match them to the AFC Championship game. Unfortunately, they were not the Super Bowl game, so uh, a little disappointing on that. But the, you know, the next best thing is the AFC Championship game if you can't have the Super Bowl. So that's you know, if you haven't seen that video, just search the Shea Townsend game use, I'm sure it'll come up. Uh, <clears throat> but I got to the end of that. I did, uh, you know, I got Joey Porter cleats in there. Two sets of Joey, Joey Porter cleats, Joey Porter gloves, Palomalu gloves. It ended up being a really good box. Uh, Rod Woodson gloves I never uh, showed on here. Uh, maybe, uh, I think I said I was going to show a picture and never did. So if I remember, I'll do that. Shout out to Eric. If he's watching this, he he, uh, he was able to pry those out of me when I needed uh, needed some money for another purchase. He bought those off me. Uh, so I got, you know, Woodson gloves. Uh, Porter gloves. I, there's a bunch of good stuff in there. The box was really good. So I bought the box and I wasn't, it was like one of those things like you got to do it now. You know, I was able to look at the stuff. I knew some of it was good. Like I knew the Townsend cleats were good. I knew they were Super Bowl year cleats. Didn't know if they were going to be, you know, pan out to be the Super Bowl cleats. So, and then I got to the point at the bottom of the box where I got the other gloves and I just let them sit for. I couldn't figure out at the time they weren't as easy to match couldn't figure out at the time and um you know it just got to that point where i was like frustrated and i just left them there so i finally dug into that box again and i was like let me try this again you know it's been like a year and let me look into it and you know i what happened was i was able to photo match the easier ones and i just left the harder ones kind of go uh so and I missed one that I could have, I would have been able to get real quickly. So, uh, so let's go into that one first. We'll do that one first. I got this one sitting here. Uh, and we will, uh, what happened was this set of gloves, I looked, they were like together like this. So I looked in, you know, I looked around and I looked and I, I never undid them. Because it didn't say, like, one, the Palomalo gloves had a note in them. The Gildan one that I haven't showed yet had a note in them. So, like, it just wasn't easily matched. I didn't I didn't take them apart. They were still Velcroed together. And I must not, and I, I knew it was older, so I thought it was a little older than I thought. So I was like, well, you know, let's see if I can. So I unvelcroed them and I started looking through all the gloves, you know, and it was autographed. So... I'm easily able to say that's Casey Hampton's autograph. So then I looked at the size and was the size matched up to Casey Hampton. And then if it's and then I was able to find a 98 in the you know inside the glove. So then I was like, oh man, I can't believe so. Then I immediately typed in Casey Hampton, went through all the things, and I finally was able to photo match them. Uh, I forget what year, so. I don't want to butcher it, so I'll go back and look, and then I'll post that with the uh, with the picture at the end. But uh, it was early; it wasn't a Super Bowl year. It was before that. It was probably his rookie season. I think it was his rookie season. Uh, so rookie season gloves is what I'm going to go with until I put it at the end of the video. But Casey Hampton gloves, used gloves. Uh, he did wear this style in the game. I haven't been able to. Uh, photo match it but if I'm able to you know that's very very distinct if I'm able to photo match that uh, but just haven't been able to at the moment so I'm just going to go with used gloves they could be practice used they could be game used so I mean I, that was a good good find so that, that makes that box even better it was definitely worth everything I got out of it I got a couple seat backs out of it I think I showed that on the video uh, three river seat backs I think I got three of them in that deal as well uh, so that was a very good buy. And then I got these. This The other one's in a helmet. Uh, 
it was uh, had number 78 in it really big gloves uh, 3XL gloves so really big hands so I thought they would go to Max Starks but as you guys know Max Starks was just at camp he was there the first time I was there I didn't have the gloves with me but he was at the uh, Friday night lights that got canceled if anybody was there I was there that day uh, so I got to meet Max Starks and that was uh, it <laughs> it got rained out uh, so luckily it wasn't just nothing you I got, I got uh, something autographed I'll show you guys that in a future video uh, but I took a glove with me the other glove that's not here and after he signed after he signed for me I said I got a question for you Max I said did you ever wear this style of glove and I, you know I showed him the glove and he said no he did not he said uh, that would predate him and he said it would match uh, oh man, I'm gonna butcher his name. He has a crazy name. Uh, Matheson, I think it was. Eric will probably be in the comment section yelling at me again, telling me the right name. Uh, but it was the, uh, number 78 before him. He was with the Steelers two or three years. Uh, I don't know much about him, I'll be honest with you. Uh, and so... Unfortunately, they are not Max Stark's gloves. He, he was able to confirm that for me. So uh, I will also put that at the end of the video or put it where I butchered his name. His name. So that way you guys know. Uh, but he was able to confirm it was probably his. He said it was that style was used uh, just before he got into the league. Uh, so he said it predated him by a year, a couple years maybe. Uh, but... That's all I got for you today. Just a little cool story time and a great, great pickup with these Casey Hampton gloves. So I'm glad to, uh, I got Casey Hampton gloves to go with my Casey Hampton jersey now. So I'm very, very happy with that. Uh, I did put some more stuff up in the cave. Uh, I'm almost all the way done with the bottoms here. As I keep telling you guys, I started working on the angles. Uh, I got a system worked out where I can, uh, you know, I can put frames on this slant these slopes and let me tell you it's not easy uh the measuring has to be precise and it's like it's kind of a headache uh so i do got two pictures up there uh on the slopes so i'm gonna order the ones i have are good for these frame these smaller frames i have but the thicker frames for these 16 by 20s i'm gonna need a thick thicker clip uh or uh, i can't remember the name for it but uh I need a thicker one so uh so once i order those i'll be able to knock out some a lot of space because i got a 16 by 20 over there horizontal and another one horizontal and once you start putting them frame six excuse me frame 16 by 20s up man they just they take up some space so you can zoom through them and get some space taken up also that uh jerome bettis poster i need a thicker one for that too so uh so hopefully i get them soon uh and I'll, I'll be able to knock out a lot of space with that and then i'll be able to clean up all this mess that's around and i'm probably gonna have to buy another uh storage tote to put the leftovers in that don't make it uh and i got a couple other things to move around that back corner you haven't seen yet and i'll put it all on this closet in here and then i'll give you guys a tour so uh don't don't quote me on this, but hopefully I'll get you something in a month or so. Uh, probably, I'm hoping by October. Let's give me until October, and I'll get you guys a fresh tour of the uh, cave here. Uh, that's all I got for you today, YouTube. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was kind of a ramble along with these gloves. So uh, I'll share pictures of the Hampton wearing this style of glove, uh, and I'll also put them other names in there like I told you before, give you the year on these and all that fun stuff maybe i'll show you them raw woodson gloves if i remember it <laughs> if i don't forget again and that's all i got for you today youtube as always have a great one stiller nation